Peter. It's good to have you on this episode of Up the Pitch. Thanks for joining us here today. Yeah, thanks so much. It's a pleasure. All right, permit me to call you Enimba's finest. <laughs> All right, so, okay, let's get right into the conversation. But let's start with an introduction. Who is Victor? And um, how long have you been playing football? Basically, what is Victor all about when it comes to football? Okay, uh, let me introduce myself well. Uh, my name is Victor Mboma. Um, I'm, I'm a striker, yeah. And um, I've been playing football um, for about uh, 10 years now. Oh, wow, that's a long time. It started very early, you know, back, back in the uh, Ramo Stars, you know, where I started. So that was when I moved on to Aqua United on loan. So I came back to Ramo Stars and uh, I'm here now in Eimba. Yeah, this is not my bus stop, you know, I'm still aiming for something higher, you know. You've had an impressive career so far, I must say playing in some of the big leagues when it comes to the NPFL, the big, big clubs when it comes to the NPFL, I'm talking about Kwa United. And currently, you are in England by one of the biggest and strongest team in the NPFL. Congratulations once again for your latest goal. Anyways, all right, so, um, talking about your career, um, I know it's a dream for every Nigerian player to somehow, somewhere in between your career, put on the green, white, green jersey. And for you, you've not made that much of an impact for the um, Super Eagles as a national team. What are your plans towards that, you know, getting caught up? Uh, my plans um, is just to do well. I want it. I wish to have it. I'm hoping. Um, you know, I have it in my mind always that someday I, I could get such an opportunity, you know. To, to you know, just wear the uh, wear that green white jersey, you know, it's a, it's a, it's, a, it's much of a big pride, you know. So I'm hoping for it someday. You will definitely get to put on the green white green jersey because you're doing so well in the MPFL and um, you're in a good club, you see. So the support goes. I mean, I think the management are already scouting and looking out for you as I speak. But again, this conversation is definitely about masters of the pitch. So let's move right into that. Let's start with your routine as a footballer. When you're not playing football, how do you spend your day? When you're off season, when you're off the pitch, how do you spend your day? Well, uh, there's just two things I do. One, I read. read I, I, uh, I like to sleep. I can sleep for a very long time. You know? Okay. So, yeah, the second one. Tell me that. <laughs> you like to sleep. <laughs> From you said you like to read and I want to know, because like I said, it's matters of the pitch. Tell us about your education background. I didn't go far in school actually. I Oh shocking. At the story where I wrote my egg. Um, I almost got into the university but it was quite unfortunate that uh, their finance wasn't there and uh, they had to sponsor my elder brother in school and like so i had to step back and i think that was what actually uh, brought me to light because uh, if not i you know i doubt if i will be playing football you know because i i would have loved to study accounting yeah so it's good that you are this side and um, you're doing what you love to do and perhaps making money off it. All right, so talking about football, who do you aspire to be in the game of football someday? I really want to be like Cristiano Ronaldo. Uh, for the sake of, uh, you know, he's a very determined person. He wants to get the job done. He wants to score goals. He's hungry, you know. So I think uh, having such a kind of person will really um, help me grow a lot, you know, so. So just to get to know you more, more outside football, what is your favorite food? What's your Nigerian favorite food? Because we know Nigerians like to swallow. Well, I mean, I'm hoping that you tell me rice or something. So, but yeah, what is swallow and what? Actually, fufu, to be precise, yeah. I like fufu and uh, vegetables. Fufu and vegetables, not the goose this time around. Okay. Let's get to know your personal life up close. Are you married? Are you single? Are you dating? Do you have kids? Just basically something personal about you. Okay, um, I'm married. Oh. Yeah, I'm married with um, two kids, two boys actually. Wow. So I have uh, 
uh, Messi and um, Cristiano Ronaldo. You know, okay, that's the encouragement there. <laughs> So this is a quiz segment of the show and I'll ask you three questions about the national team. If you fail to answer all three of them, you're going to do me a song as a penalty. So get set to answer all three of them correctly if you do not want to try your singing career right here. Okay? So um, the first question goes, um, the Super Eagles was formed in what year? That's the national team. The national team, the Super Eagles, performed in what year? I think that was 1973. Okay, Victor, I am embarrassed for you. But anyways, you got that one wrong. <laughs> the Super Eagles, the national team, that name was given in 1945. That is according to the NFL. Anyway. But anyways, this is the second question. Which country the Super Eagles of Nigeria defeat during the Olympics 96? to win the gold medal. Argentina. Uh, I didn't expect you to get that one, but yeah, you got to defeat Argentina 2-0 to win the gold medal during the Olympics 96. And my final question is, this one I take job. If you don't take it, eh, you will sing me two songs for that matter. <laughs> what is the full meaning of the NFF? NFF. Yes. Iran Football Federation. Okay, bravo. You got, you got that one. But again, you still have to do me a song because you failed the cheapest question easily. I was saying uh, Michael Lynch to rock. I won't forget the way you kiss me. The feeling. Hey. So okay, let's not start a war. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I don't want to. Well, that was amazing. You made me blush, actually. So thank you so much, Victor, for your time. But I will leave you without saying your parting words to your fans, your family, your friends, your loved ones, and of course, whoever out there that will be watching this video. Well, um, I want to say a very big thank you at first um, for me being on the show. It's a great, I mean, it's a very big pleasure. It's a great pleasure. I'm honored. And um, I want to say... Um, to my fans that um, I'm doing my I'm doing my best I'm trying I'll keep doing my best I'll make sure I don't fail them because um, if I fail them I'm disappointed with myself too and um, and I hope and pray to God that someday um, I will be up there and um, it will be, it will be much for me to extend my hands to everyone and everyone will be happy you know good luck once again and congratulations again for your one million naira win Ha, 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 ha.